Have you people testing positive and they're sending you home? They're sending you home, man. Hello, good afternoon, Mr. Ian. Andy, good evening. We're live on national television. Yes, yes. Uh, give me a call. Andy, this is the guy I am speaking with who stood by the gate and he was, he, we did an interview with him. His father and his brother died as a result of corona. The father, right. the, the father died. The son died on Saturday. Right? When I don't know if my, if my camera guy could just give me a shot of him at the gate, please. Right? Awesome. Just want to get it. Right, beautiful. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I want to tell you something today. Here, yeah, I want to ask you something. How are you coping? Mr. Ian Allen, what can describe the feeling that we're experiencing right now? Both kids, my son, my mother, my wife, and my two innocent children, we traumatized. But I, I heard, I heard that they told you to stay on for 10 more days. Yes, that's true. Up until this evening, around three Thursdays, when I was supposed to the CMO, for the area when I contacted to get our vitals, yeah. they instructed that, um, instructed that we will have to uh, quarantine days or further extend for 10 more days. But after that 10 more days, would you be doing a test? They say no more tests? Well, this is the thing. This is what I was trying to contact you since yesterday. Because I find something... I didn't have your number saved. I didn't have your number saved. Sorry. <laughs> because what I tell you, Trent, now, we're not experiencing any symptoms here as of present, right? Mm -hmm. Now, when my brother first um, got his positive test, he was in contact with someone who was positive at his worst place. No call no names, yeah? no call anybody please. Mm. Uh -huh. No, no, we're not calling no names, but uh. at his this contracted the uh, he was in contact with someone that were who had true life So those of you who are listening, and this is the father and son that die. I have I, I have the surviving son on the phone here. Go ahead. Right? So within about five days after he started to get true life symptoms. And Someone else from his workplace called and tell him that the guy who was with them tested positive this morning. So if anybody having flu like symptoms, we need to go and get tested tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Right? This would have been two weekends ago. Uh -huh. Right? So he went to um, his company and then he and uh, I think two other co-workers to um, South Coast Medical uh -huh. where they would have had their test done. On Wednesday of that week, they um he got his results saying that he is positive. He was instructed to remain at home on that self quarantine and wait it out. In case they are having any symptoms of short breath, contact your nearest district health center. Right? He was instructed to and he got his results. So at this time Five days already passed. Obviously, the entire family would have interacted with him at some way or the other. We live in well, I can't same understand. Ready. Hold on. I cannot understand how they tell you no more tests because let me tell you something. I tell you, I, as I tell somebody, I saw positive in my life. When I went core, I couldn't get a negative enough. Yeah, man. <laughs> I, 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 I got to make you laugh a little bit. And, 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 and I know you're right now. I can't smile. I have something to ask. I find out something. I find out something and I, find, I realize you're in a little problem. And next problem now, I realize you're in a next problem. And I'll help you, I'll help you. Here, what's going on? When I was in Cora, the amount of tests I did, they pushed this thing up my nose one time. Then it has some nice, just come and do that again. Then I said to them, one time my results lost. Next time, the girl said she didn't push it up too good. All kind of things. And it went on and it went on. But I did a, the amount of tests I did, the amount of tests I did to come out. Let me tell you something unbelievable. And now they're telling you no more tests again after 10 days. Your case, your case when you lost your father and your, and your brother. 
It's a very, I mean, it, it is not a normal case. It is not a normal, it's not normal circumstances. I mean, it's sad. The whole, the whole thing to lose a, 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 a mother, a, a father one day, a brother the day before, and then you surviving. And now they're telling you, they're telling you here what's going on. Ten more days, but no tests after that. It's like, how no more tests? So, so you, I mean, you're not scared, scared or anything? So, Mr. Yana, you know, let me give you something better than all of that. Let, let, let me put these sprinkles on top of the ice and pain, all right? Now, lo and behold, two weeks ago, my brother got his results on the Wednesday, right? Yeah. It's the last week Wednesday, my brother passed. A week prior to that, that's when he had the results that he positive. Right. He still say they think the MO call and instructed that the rest of the family go and get a swap test done the Friday morning. Uh, penal health right? So, so wait, let me ask you something. If your brother was positive, right? Uh huh. So they didn't make no they, Then they tell all of them to leave and go up the road. Yeah, they tell us no. So, then, so what about if you like interact with your brother and what? Not and he touch the kitchen and he touch this, huh? They, they, they told us that we have primary contact with him, right? Now, lo and behold, he would have already have this virus four into five days when he started to show symptoms now. Eh? So they instructed us to go at the penal health center for 12.45 or something like to get tested. Uh. So we went to myself, my mom, my dad, my wife, and my two children. Right. And we went to, um, to the penal health center. We went and got a swab test on, the, on, Saturday, on Friday. Uh -huh. They instructed that we are now, we sign our recent document that we are on home, we are on quarantine for the next 14 days. Right? A week passed, no results. Uh -huh. I lose my brother and my father. Still, I haven't gotten a result yet. Eh? You know, it's only yesterday. Right? So your brother After and father did. Your brother and father did. And, up, right? and you didn't get a result. How, how long after? It was, it was, well, that would have been a week on, almost 10 years after. 10 days after. Yes, he he know, he know, he know, he know, he know, he know, he results. I know, he results that I tested positive. Well, even everybody could, well, everybody's obvious, everybody would know that. Everybody, <laughs> so I just showed no, you, but, but you remember they leave the brother home and they went out. So I just, but, but, but. But let me ask you something now, but you're getting help from the community and the temple and everybody helping you out, I think? Yes, yes. Who's your MP for your area? You see the village of Mauritius. Well, Mauritius, everybody lives nice here, I know them. Right, they know us and they're coming forward, they're helping in every single way possible. That trace is not the same trace, right? Well, that, that, was, that, that was flooded out, I think, a couple of years ago. Yeah, yeah. I that didn't come. I, I, I think I came in that road and I give out hampers and mattress and water. Yes, yes. The Mauritius um, is on the San Francisco road going it's to on the San Francisco road. I went to that trace. I, I know it's that trace. Let me ask you something now. So, who is your MP for your area? I think it's Mr. Lacramboro. He did contact me. Eh? Like, uh, this is the, the, oh, the, the, the MP for your area, Lacramboro. So, I guess that he would have dropped stuff for you and little. Um, he, he would have dropped um, groceries and whatnot for you, a little hamper to, to sustain all what, 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 what did the MP give to you? Three cases of Oasis water. And that was delivered on the same day last week, Friday, when your camera guy was doing the interview at my gate. What did the MP give you? Three cases of water? Yeah, three cases of water. You're, you're, you're sure the MP. Do, um, you're sure the MP not mixing you up for 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 the residents in La Sufri where 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 they, where, where, where they need water and, and whatnot because I don't understand water nothing no. to eat no groceries nothing no coffee nothing no, nothing, nothing, nothing. Like, three cases of no. water three cases of water water I forget to um the Senate the 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 when I send the invoice for the funeral home for this another picture three cases case of water. water your MP gave you. Lacrim, Buru, shame on you, boy. If this were the man saying, three case, three stinking case of water, you give. This case that brought national attention, local and internationally, 
People were all over the world. Father died. Son died one day. The father died the next day. And where, where, where you, you're, you're really supposed to be channeling? I mean, there, 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 there are many cases. There are a lot of cases. A lot of our people now working right now. You give these people three cases of water. And it's nothing to do with UNC and, and whatever, you know. I mean, I know you well. But three cases of water? Three cases? That is all you get a smart? So, and just a little children and all kind of thing. You see the villagers of Mauritius, really? friends and um, everyone who would have known my brother from his workplace, especially like his co-workers and my brother's supervisors on him, they are the persons that reach out to us the most and the villagers in my community. But partner, I'm feeling sick. I can't believe, I can't believe you lost your daddy, you lost your, you lost your brother. How many, how many children you have? I have two children, a son and a daughter. Three, uh, how old are they? Uh, my daughter is a year old. She turned a year last month. And my son is two years. And you carry three cases of water. Did you bring three cases of water? I try. I God, I still can't believe that. That's it. That, but that's the most shocking thing. That is the most shocking thing in the whole right now. The most shocking thing right now. Three cases of water. The other, um, the other message that I get from them, they ask if anybody has assistant us to us, well, so we haven't received any calls. But then you are the MP. So they tell us, well, um, here yeah, what to do. The person you have doing your photo here, which would be my cousin, who took care of the... Um, Three cases of water. Hold on. Hold on. You stay said. on the phone here. Yeah. Hold on, yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Stay on the phone. Three cases of yeah. water. Let's imagine that. Three cases of water, the MP give, give them. Three cases of water, that is all. That is all. Three cases of water, yeah? His salary never cut. His salary never cut. Just imagine. Up to this day, he, them, oh, he's, they were telling, none of them care, you know? And that, and that goes for all sides. Nobody care. Come back to me. I'm going to take a fast break. And when I come back, I want, there's an exciting story that you, you yourself didn't know. Start sharing it all over. Call your friends. Let me take a break. I'll come back. Stay on the phone, young man.